Alright, there we go. Hi everyone, how's it going? Team here, and this is a Friday live stream for non-content bollocks, and uh, today I want to play Rise of Industry, which is a new Transport Tycoon game. Uh, first of all, thank you very much to GOG guys for uh, hooking me up with a copy of it. Uh, it is game in development, or early access, as it's called on Steam, so it's not yet finished. As you can see here, it's a build version 0.5. But um, from what I've seen so far, it actually looks amazingly cool. And uh, I've, I mean, I've played tutorial only so far, but there is insane amount of complexity here. So we are going to be jumping into hell I know what and um, trying not to basically blow it up, right? Um, hey, Renato, how's it going? All right, so let's just go in with a career. Come on, game. I want to... What? Game. Did I just broke it? <laughs> um, I think I think I broke it actually. What? What? Okay, you know what? <laughs> let, let me restart it real quick. I think something went wrong. Okay, there we go. Um, come on, Twitch. So we skipped it to. to yeah, okay. I think now it's. Yeah, there you go. Okay. So I guess it was hanging in the background for a bit too long. Cool. Seems to be working now. Let's jump in for a career and uh, gonna go for uh, first timers. Yes, I think we're gonna go for the newcomer because hell of this game is complex. All right. So it it's looks very or not looks but rather feels very similar to the Transport Tycoon Deluxe, which is my one of like my favorite tycoon games ever, and I'm, I think I'm still playing the open source version. I mean, it's it's in development game, so there's nothing really I can do about breaking it. There's plenty of bugs. I mean, again, you know, version 0 0.5. So, hey, what do you expect? All right, so we got this maps to ourselves. It is pretty big. We got a bunch of cities here. And uh, first of all, I think we have to select this specialization. So you can specialize in the things which allows you to unlock some stuff that you can build. Um, I think the easiest one to start with is farming, essentially. So we're not going to do anything crazy. I'm just going to specialize in farming. And uh, we are going to unlock a uh, crop farm right away. And uh, this is basically what was in the tutorial. So you like you unlock crop farm, you unlock the vegetable field. And this is basically what you're going to be building. So farm, um, where are we going to build the farm? We need to find a decent city that has a good demand. So there's a crazy economy system. There's like global market with demand and uh, supply and everything so we can see raw products so we're gonna trade in vegetables right there's the vegetables and there's like 100 percent demand right now and uh, zero stock obviously so no one's supplying them so let's see this is a city and it has a deli which is a shop which might be nice for us because they sell food so we might uh, provide them with food a farmer's market that sells raw vegetables i believe right so they sell... No, they actually trade in raw vegetables, which is weird. Okay, so this is not the town we want to go for. Let's see, what is this? Oh, okay, this is our office probably. Um, let's see, we got this one. So first we got to find where we basically will be able to sell our stuff. Uh, there we go, we got vegetables over here. And they have 115% demand here. So we might as well um, buy a permit here. So... To start working in the area, you need to purchase a permit from the city, which costs money. So it's like almost $300,000. I mean, we have 25 million, so that should be fine. Now let's go for that. We're going to buy the permit. Now we're going to build um, a farm, right? So we are going to go for the crop farm. We should not build too close to the city because there is some sort of a reputation system. And basically, if you pollute the city and build too close to it, they will be angry with you and... Uh, won't buy anything from you. So we got to be careful about that. So let's build a farm, I guess, maybe somewhere here. So the thing is that farm, I think farm needs water. So we have to be careful about placing as well. So we have to have a close place with water. Okay, you know what? We can place a farm over here. I just place those fields. One, two, and three. There we go. And now we have to configure production. So you can actually... Farms can produce a bunch of stuff and we unlock the vegetables separately. So we're going to switch to vegetables here. And um, now that we have this production, it needs water, right? So, right. Okay. So now we need to build the water 
thing which we don't have. So we actually have to go to the gathering and unlock the water siphon here. And now we can build that water siphon. Um, somewhere close to water would be good and not that far away from the uh, road, right? Because we need them connected. So let's put the water siphon here. How do you... Why is it... Why can't I place? Must be on non-blocked coast tile. Okay, can we build it here? So one... Maybe that is not one. Okay, can I do I need to terraform that? That is not perfect. Can I build it somewhere here? Ugh. Okay, that is not a very good place. Maybe here? Ah, there you go. Okay, that works. Um, do we need third one? Ah, why not? Let's put three of them. Okay. So now that we've built those, we need to connect them with the roads, right? So we build a road here. You have to be efficient with that as well because the roads are somewhat expensive, I guess. So connect this and then we connect this to here. All right. So now that the uh, water siphon is here, we need to say that, okay, now you deliver water to farm, right? So whatever you have, we just throw it in here. Now the farm will take in water and produce vegetables. So we need to sell vegetables to the farmer's market, which means that, I mean, obviously you can just say, okay, farm deliver stuff to the um, commercial, to the farmer's market, but that is non-efficient as far as I understood. And what we have to do is we have to actually um, research logistics. So we're gonna open the truck depot. I don't think we need any other, oh, we don't have any more points, right? So we have one industry point and one more farming point. Not gonna spend those yet. So we unlock logistics, which means we can now build the truck depots. I'm gonna put one over here and I'm gonna put the other one right in the city so that we can, I guess, right with uh, next to the farmer's market would be perfect. So now I can say that the uh, crop farm delivers stuff to our truck depot that is really close. And then this truck depot have a new route which uh, takes vegetables and delivers them to the other truck depot, right? So this is basically they will um, move them and this will be acting as a warehouse. And from here we take those vegetables and actually deliver them to the farmer's market and that should do it. Okay, uh, auto save in progress. Okay, I'll take that. So as you can see, the game is quite tricky so there's like i'm this is basically i just repeated what the tutorial did and uh, i honestly have no idea if i did everything correct so we're gonna observe this for a bit let me speed this up um so we have okay water production is now finished so we got cars driving the water here now the cars are driving the water to the crop farm and i guess now the crop farm actually produces vegetables seems to be going all right we spend 1.3 million doing that which is um, sub perfect, but I mean, you know, you gotta start somewhere. Okay. So we produce some crops. So they deliver to Truck Depot, and Truck Depot now delivers them over here. Okay, good, good. Can we see our balance? So we didn't sell anything yet, and now they are delivered to the farmer's market. And uh, farmer's market actually pay us. So there's still there is uh, more demand than supply, so that's good. All right, cool. So we are actually doing stuff. Um, what else can we do? So there is a crazy recipe book over here. Um, it it has insane amount of stuff you can do. Okay, so we can hop sweat. So what, what do they, let's see, what does this city actually buy? That's already someone else doing something. Who's this guy? Fisherman. Hmm. Maybe you can sell fish as well, but since he's selling fish here, maybe that's not a good idea. There is some... Wait a second, what is this here? This is copper ore and iron ore. So maybe we can... Uh, paper mill. There's a coal right in the city. What the... Okay. So what do we have here? We have a farmer's market wholesaler. He produced... Okay, he buys water. Um... We might as well sell some water, I guess. No, we're, we're not. We actually need that water, right? So we need to get more water if we want to sell it. So we're not going to do that. We've got the hardware store. So cardboard, uh, glassware, milk, oil, paper. Maybe it's a good idea to just build something else somewhere else. So let's try. Well, this is going on uh, there. We can try to build something. 
So Jesus, there are so many businesses already. Okay. Yeah, I guess this is our concurrence office, right? Yeah, okay. Um, oh my god, there's so many things already. Okay, he just built an orchard right in town. All right. I guess you could do that as well. So let's see. And there, there's my god. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna pause the game because this is insane. Everywhere I look, there's something already built. Um, can I actually compare myself to the, the competitors? Some additional charts would be good, but I don't think that's in the game yet. Okay, let's see. What else can we do? Let's see. So we have... Um, I don't have any gathering points. We have a farmer and an industry point. So we can build or chart, but what would that give us? So apples. Can we do something with apples? Um, so orchard produces apples, which means that we need some factory, I guess, food factory. Cheese dough, apple smoothie, but that uh, that requires a lot of stuff. Um, sounds like a very complicated thing. All right, let's see. Plantation. No, those, those are all beyond our reach right now. So maybe what do we have here? We have irrigation. So we can actually, yeah, well, let's go for irrigation to get more fields, right? So we can actually just expand our current uh, farm. Just buy a couple more fields. Add field. Yes, there you go. One more, one more. Cool. And we actually need more water now, right? So let's see. Can I... Um, we don't have a gathering point yet. All right, maybe it's really worth setting up more farms. Uh, so let's see who of those guys actually get uh, has a good demand for vegetables. Not them. So we're not going to sell anything to them. So what do they have? They have an orchard here, but they don't have anything related to vegetables. So we got a diner, we got a farmer's market, and they do have a pretty huge vegetable demand, actually. So we might as well build over here. And let me pause the game real quick. So... Let's start by building the water siphon. Uh, all right, I have to buy the permit first. A okay, purchase permit, yes. Uh, so we're gonna start with a water siphon. Um, no, 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 no. Right. Um, I think I'm just gonna place it like this, right? Okay. So we're gonna put this thing here. This take it. What? Um, must be built in the owner's range. Ah, oh, come on. I have to terraform that to build them. Oh no, that is not very good. How do I terraform stuff? Um, is there a way to terraform? Actually, no, there's a way to demolish, right? But odd harvester. Um, maybe that was a terrible idea to build it there. So let's see if I demol actually get some money back. Okay, so it's not terrible. Not all money, but uh, that's fine. So we actually want to build it somewhere here. Like this, maybe? Yeah, that seems to be fine. So can build one here, one here, and one here. Cool. Now we connect that with the road. Uh, there we go. And now we can build a farm, right? So farm needs to be somewhere here. So sort of in the middle between the um, water and the town. Okay. Get some fields in. Construction alert. Yeah, 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 I just did that. That's good. Oh, what? Okay, auto save actually hangs the game. Right, I can have a five fields now. That's always good. So we're going to produce vegetables. And now we're going to connect this to this. We're going to connect this to this, right? Okay, now we need the logistics bit. So truck depot right across it because why the hell not? Then the second truck depot, where was the market? There's the market. So we want it um, right here, I guess. I don't know if that's efficient enough. Okay, so you delivered the water to truck depot. No, not truck depot. That's not what I want. Oh, I wanted a farm, right? This farm, right? Okay, you deliver the vegetables to the truck depot. Yes, and you deliver this vegetables. Come on to the no to the logistics 20 tiles yes this is the closest one and now you sell those row components to the commercial farmers market nine tiles that sounds about right okay let's start this so i got two farms now theoretically they should be working let's see can we build another one somewhere so 
What does this do? This does orchard apples. Uh, they have they have a farmer's market and they do need um, vegetables as well. Can we just deliver vegetables from... No, that's, a, that's quite far away. So let's build another farm. Let's see if we can actually just make a business out of purely building farms. So we got some water here, which... Um, can I actually uh, fit any of the siphons? I'm not even sure. So this might might be worth, you know what? Let's try to set up the um, logistics network maybe. So let's try to set up a depot here and then haul the vegetables all the way from there. Okay, I need a permit. That's probably gonna go terribly wrong, but you know what? Let's try that anyway. Okay, you also put that here, truck depot five. Can you rename? Yeah, you can. Okay, cool. So we need to transport vegetables from this depot to truck depot five. Vegetables, uh, logistics, truck depot five. There you go. And then this depot sells our vegetables to the commercial market and tiles. Okay, so we we don't even have to build anything there basically. Okay, what else can we do? We got this. This is the office. We're not interested in that. What do we have here? He's already building some paper mill and paper mill. What is paper mill? Can I get that as well? That actually doesn't. So opening R&D doesn't pause anything. So I have to be careful about that. So paper mill unlocks paper and cardboard. Um, okay. Carpentry. Do you just want to go for like carpentry or something? Or maybe... We don't have points here, we don't have points here, so we can only open... So basically, because he's already doing paper mill and like paper stuff, I think we would go for something different. Maybe food factory? Let's try food factory. So to do food factory... So what does food factory produce? Um, cheese. We need water and milk. How do we get water and milk? I wonder, can they just buy ingredients from those guys? So they... Umbriard, they sell... I mean, water I can get, right? So water is easily uh, retrievable from the things that I've built already. Where's my farm? Where is my farm? No, that's not my farm. Is it here? No, that's no. This is my farm, right. Okay, so we got water here. Question is, can we buy milk from not hardware store for sure? We can buy milk from here. Can we buy it? Fully demanded. I know that it is fully demanded. So, okay, you need a livestock farm and then you need wet and that will result in a cow that will result in meat, milk and leather. Right. Um, livestock farm. Okay, so we can actually unlock it once we get more R&D points. Okay, let us continue. So what's, how does... So we earned 156,000 in past months, which is not terrible. I mean, we spent way more, but uh, you know, at least we're going in plus, I think. Expenses and building, um, upkeep. So upkeep is not that much. So we're actually in the plus now, right? Aside from the money we spend on building that stuff. Okay, how do I earn R&D points? I have no... It seems like they... What? I think... What just happened? Oh, ah, right. I just got a bit confused because I set up the notifications and... Uh, I guess I, I'm going to butcher your username. I'm really sorry, but uh, Kmiasko? Kmiasko? Just followed, so thank you very much for following me. I was just startled by the notification. <laughs> okay. Right, let's see. Um, I guess we're going to run on a normal speed. And uh, let's see what do we have here. Um, crop farm vegetables. Really want to do something different. Okay, so we're gonna wait for more of that. So I guess the only option is really try to sell it on more towns. We don't really have anything else to do right now. So let's see what does this town do. They... Okay, so you can buy stuff from wholesaler. Okay, hardware store does not sell, liquor store does not sell. The... Right, so is it like you can only buy from the wholesaler, I guess, not from the market, which is, I mean, I would like buy milk for now and then sell something, you know, more complicated, but since you cannot really do that, whatever. Right, we still, no, I unlocked the food factory, right? 
Um, okay, okay, let me think. He already built iron mines and stuff. How do you get research points? I feel like I'm missing something. Trade routes, recipe, info. Okay, let's see. Info. Um, tech tree. Major unlocks, passive unlocks. Hmm, specialization, gathering, farming, focuses, and blah, blah, blah. Okay, um, tech tree is your pass. To unlock those upgrades, you will need to gain experience with this by using the buildings you have access to. Okay, so basically the more you it just over, uh, accumulates over time, right? We just have to wait, basically. Okay, he built a coal mine right in the city. That's ought to go well. Um, right, what we can do? Right, let's see the other towns. Do you guys need farms? Because I have farms and I can sell you vegetables. Farmers markets. Uh, you, Coco, yes, you do need vegetables. And you have a huge demand for that. There is oil, so let's not build near that. So let's build a per uh, get a permit here. And I guess we can build over here. That sounds like a good plan. Uh, so let's see, we need the water siphon first. Um, perm oh, is that a different region already? Oh, okay, it is. Um, okay, I guess so we can build over there. Let's go, let's do this. So we already have a road here because he built it. So we're just gonna abuse that. Mm, let's see, one near, I uh, want to build near the flat structures, right? Somewhere here, maybe. Maybe, uh, so we can build this. Ah, that is slightly, like you can use the right click to scroll the map around. But it also cancels the building that you selected, which is somewhat annoying. Right, okay, let's put it here. One, two, three. Good. We can um, connect that, connect that here. And connect this here. So now we can actually build a farm, right? And start selling our uh, goods. And probably even just, whoops. Um, well, close enough. One, two, three, four, five. Cool. First of all, connect it with the road. Second of all, you are gonna deliver it to the closest farm, right? Okay, um, logistics. We do need logistics because we are on uh, quite a distance here and I mean, it's always more efficient. So I'm gonna plop the one truck depot over here, the other one over here. I should probably start naming things because truck depot 6, truck depot 7, whatever, doesn't really help. So first of all, vegetable fields. Cats, please stop going crazy. Okay, destination. We are going to go for logistics, truck depot and three tiles. And we're going to take this one and uh, deliver veggies to the truck depot 7, right? I think it's 7. 7, yes. Okay, good. And you are going to deliver veggies to the commercial farmer's market in 12 times. Okay, cool. So we got another chain set up. How's my tech tree looking? So we got... Um, the R&D points gain are like super slow. I guess we can just spit it up. Okay, while we are at it, can we do... Can we sell vegetables here? Farms Uh, Yeah, we can. Uh, the demand is not that big, but uh, okay, maybe he. What is this? This is a coal mine. Okay, so this guy specializes in coal. It seems. Let's see, what is this? Cocoa plantation apples. Um, there's a farmers market, and they do need some vegetables as well. So we can can go for that. Purchase permits. Thank you very much. And uh, while we are at it, so where would be the best place? I guess this this would be the nice place for the water siphon, right? We can turn it this way, I guess. And then, um, how do I there you go? One, two, three. So we connect that with the roads. There we go. And then we can connect over here. Okay, we got the trucks going. I guess it makes sense to slow down a bit, not to waste any resources. Right, crop farm, um, right over here. We got the fields going. Three, whoop. Um, I know that some of you will hate me for this, but I'm just gonna leave it like this. <laughs> right, we're gonna produce vegetables. And uh, you are gonna deliver water to the farm. Okay, now I guess we need 
We need logistics, right? Truck depot. And truck depot. Where's the farmer's market? It's over there. And there's not a very good place. I mean, I guess we can plop it here. Why not? Truck depot. Eight. You take your vegetables and uh, deliver them to truck depot nine. Here's the question. Wait a second. Did I configure the logistics for the previous thing? Yeah, I probably didn't actually need logistics here, but whatever. Okay. So here's the question. I built the previous farm right here. Where was it? I don't know if I remember where I did that. Uh, here, right. Oh, come on. All the save. Stop hanging my game. Come on. Right, here we go. Okay, so the farm destination. Yes, good. It's all good. Okay, cool. Right, we got that. So how does our... Okay, we're getting significantly more points right now. Or, well, for everything but industry, basically, because we don't really have any industry running. We might try to build food factory just to see what it takes. Okay, we spent... Spent half a mil. Uh, 50k last time. Yeah, I mean, we're doing things. We're doing things. So it seems to be okay. Um, fishing. Yeah, fishing looks like fun. Maybe I should have done that as well. Really like the graphics, by the way. I mean, they're very minimalistic, but very nice looking. Okay, vegetables. Can I do something to the farm? So we have the storage. Aha, so you do have analytics for... Um, Turn off warehouse pickups. So you do have analytics for each specific building. Uh, keep dispatched, trucks dispatched. Okay. Um, right, so what about this city? Can we sell the vegetables to them? Yes, we actually can. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to plop another... Because it doesn't make sense to build another um, farm here. So I'm just going to purchase the permit. So I'm going to plop in... Uh, come on, no. Uh, what was the no what was the f okay i'm gonna plop a truck depot right here i'm gonna say okay you take the veggies and sell them to commercial farmers market and then you take the veggies and deliver them to truck depot 10 it's the 10th one right yeah okay cool so now we're selling in both towns all right, we're doing it. Um, let's see, what else do we have? Metham. I do sell it to them as well. Okay, good. We do that. Quite far away, but uh, whoops. See what we have here. Farmers markets. They do want vegetables as well. <coughs> <coughs> Apologies. Okay, um, this guy has a cocoa and apples plants here, so we can build a farm here as well so let's go for it purchase a permit that i'm soon gonna run out of all of my money so i gotta be, gotta be careful about that let's go with water siphon um yes i guess we can build it like this maybe one two three so connect that now <clears throat> now that might have been a mistake. Do I have to go all the way around to connect to it? I mean, we can of, of course do it like this. Where the hell do I build a farm now? That was that was a terrible placing. <laughs> let's, let's be honest about that. All right, let's see crop farm. Um, we need some space for it, so I guess like this maybe. Two, three, four. Five. Okay, good. Uh, you are going to produce vegetables. And, uh, okay, no destination yet. Let us connect those. So it's going to do this way. Uh, you deliver water to that farm, right? There you go. Okay. Now we need logistics. And, uh, yeah, this is going to be quite a roundabout, but uh, whatever. I plop it here. So you deliver the vegetables to the truck depot 11. I'm gonna plop a truck depot 12. Uh, yeah, that looks fine. So take the veggies and sell them off in farmer's market. 
Right. I don't know if I'm doing it efficiently. Probably not. I'm gonna take the vegetables and deliver them to Drug Depot 12. And uh, you are already delivering. Okay, good. We set up another chain. So we are still losing money, by the way. Um, I don't don't know how that's gonna work out in the end, but we're gonna see. Okay, Everson, do you want vegetables? Uh, yes, you do, and you actually have a quite huge demand for them. Okay, so I don't think it's worth building another farm, so we're just gonna pull the vegetables from here. We need a permit anyway, right? We are gonna build a truck depot. There we go. And uh, this truck depot will take the vegetables and sell them to the farmer's market. And this truck depot, yes, we'll start taking veggies to the truck depot. No, that's not what I want. Truck depot 13. There you go. So now we're delivering to two places. Good. Um, oh, we got a point, I think. Let me slow this down a bit. Tech tree. What do we have? We have um, gathering industry logistics. We got a new logistics thing. So what can we unlock? We can unlock urban roads. What does is, what is roads actually give you? Is there any explanation? Locked, locked, track. Wait, there's trains? Why did nobody tell me about that? So what does roads actually give you? Does, is there any explanation of, I guess, let's try help. Um, buildings, no, logistics, trade routes. Uh, that is not what I want. Depots, warehouses, how, what is the difference in roads? Are they like faster or something? Hey, what? Uh, oh, it's autosave again. God damn it. It's like, oh, it's frozen. No, it's just autosave. 25 initial, 25. Oh, okay, so it's a speed increase basically mostly, right? So we can... Plus two trade track capacity. 25 trade dispatch cost. Hmm. You know what? Let's go for more trucks. That's always good. Okay, we are not putting anything in the industry, but the farming will probably soon gain us another point. So we can unlock. Uh, we can actually do the cows bit, right? So we have farms now. We can build a wet farm and then we can get the cows and we will get milk and leather and stuff and then we can actually use a milk we can do the food production because we have the, the food uh, thing in industry so that should work let's see come on where's my points take faster there we go okay we got this so we can unlock the livestock uh, unlocks chickens um cows are a separate thing okay here's the question food factory cheese and orange juice Oh my god, why is it so complicated? <laughs> All right, let's see. Factory, food factory. So cheese is milk and water. Dough is wet. Oh, wait, but dough is locked, right? So it was an unlock. What I use chickens for? I would assume it was in a, in a, in a food factory as well, but it doesn't really seem so. Hmm. Apple smoothie, okay. That seems doable, but is it unlocked from the get-go? So no, it's a separate unlock. And we cheese and orange juice. That's literally the only two we can do, right? So cheese requires milk. Milk requires cows, and we don't have cows yet. Um, so uh, this is unlock. And what was the orange juice? Yes, so we need carton, we need oranges, and we... <laughs> Why is it so hard? Okay, that's sort of the way those recipes unlock is kind of, I don't know, a bit weird, I would say. Ops, vegetables. Okay, we got that livestock farm. So chickens actually produce meat and egg. Oh, okay. So we, let's see. We can actually probably sell that, right? So we got this town, for example, and I think the, um, the wholesale market, so they buy meat at least. And they buy eggs. Okay, cool. So we can actually um, do it here. So what do we need? Uh, we got another point from somewhere. Uh, gathering. No, we got farming. Another farming point. Oh, wait a second. We can actually unlock. No, we can't. Uh... Oh, because I didn't unlock it. All right. I didn't spend the point. God damn it. Okay. So, yeah. We can actually build the livestock farm, right? And do the chickens. So let's do this. Um, livestock farm. 
Yes, not too close to the city. And we also want to be kind of close to the water. Okay, we... Whoops. Why is it zoom jumping so much? One, two, three. So, yes, you're going to... So, we need wet and we need water, which means we need a crop farm. Um, let's build it somewhere here, maybe. Um, no, thank you very much. Let me just close this real quick. Okay, we got this. You're going to produce wet. Yes, there you go. Okay, this is getting more and more complicated. I can't imagine playing this on normal or hard. That sounds like absolute hell. Uh, but I probably would actually play that. Okay, we got that. So we deliver wet now. Now we need water. Um, I would say we need another one of those uh, water siphons. Uh, just gonna plop it here maybe. One, two, three. Now connect that stuff over here and here. So this farm also needs water, right? Yep. So you are going to deliver water. Oh, but we can deliver to the three destinations. So we have to build. Um, this is why you need logistics, actually, right? Because you have to distribute it. Okay, so we build the logistic thing. Um, I guess let's build it over here. So you deliver this to the truck depot 14. Truck depot 14 takes water. Uh, where's water? Squiggly thing water. Uh, so you deliver it to farm, crop farm, and you take the water and deliver it to livestock farm. Okay, so now we have the water delivery set up. Oh my god, this is so. Okay, so we got the water, we got the wet. You deliver wet directly, right? Yeah, okay. So now the chickens, you take the chickens. I oh, know it actually produces meat. How do you. Okay, I'm not just using tech tree. All right, logistics, uh, truck depot 14. Why is it only meat? I thought it produces eggs and meat. It's a bit weird. Okay, whatever. I guess it's just because we didn't unlock the thing. Okay, so you take this and you take the meat and deliver it to the... Dear game, stop auto saving and freezing everything. Okay, um, truck depot two, yes, right. And truck depot two takes that meat and sells it on a farmers market one, which is this one. I think they do have a demand for me. Yeah, they this is actually quite expensive. Okay, so let's see if all of that works out. Um, So storage, they get water, they produce a more wet. A wet takes quite some time to grow. Okay, um, hope that's worth it. I mean, truck depot has nothing in storage. Okay, so what's what's about? Oh, there are eggs there, so I just can't deliver them, which is annoying. Unlock the slot using tech tree. Uh huh. All right. So how do I unlock the slots? Is it in logistics? Um, hell if I know. What are those? Vehicle speed, lower building cost, capacity of logistics building, building upkeep. So how do I unlock it? It was farm, right? Build upkeep livestock. Oh, there you go. So it's a basically a separate destination. Locks the ability to place. No, five fields. No, wait a second. There's a different thing. How they? Where do you unlock that? It's got to be in logistics, right? Oh, one dispatch slot. There you go. Okay. Right. Got it. Just have to wait a bit. Um, I guess we're gonna waste all of those chickens. Um, capacity fifty units per slot. How many slots do we have? Okay, a uh, new model chocolate bar. Whoa, 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 what is that? A new model has come out and people are dying to get their hands on it. Chocolate bar price plus 25%. Oh, so there are events. That's nice. Head of schedule. Food factory production plus 25. Um, 
Okay, what is food factory? I guess none of those are mine, so I don't care. <laughs> okay, we got a new point, so let's have a look. Uh, we got a point in what? In far? No, in gathering. Okay. So water siphon. Okay, five siphons. We don't really need that. Should I go for fishing? Why? Well, you know what? Let's go for fishing. Let's just install fishing somewhere. So we already have a fisherman pier here. How about this one? So do you buy fish? Fisher's market. Yeah, you do buy fish. Okay, cool. Uh, we can just buy a fisherman thing. Fisherman pier over. I place it somewhere here. Oh, I need a permit here. Okay, I haven't. I thought I already bought a permit here. Okay. Can't get a permit. Come on. Come on. I need. Yes. Thank you very much. Purchase a permit. Okay, uh, now let us build the Fisherman Pier. I am quickly running out of money, so... Okay, the Fisherman Pier. Um, that might have been a terrible placing because there is quite literally no fish there. I'm an idiot. I should have, should have checked if there's a fish anywhere. Okay, is there any... Okay, I see fish here. I see fish here. I see some fish here, which is not that much. So I guess we can place it over here, yeah. Checking if there's actually fish before building a f fishing place is uh, generally a good idea. Okay, place on top of the resource. Um, two units deep. Uh, come on, that is... How do you... Well, rotation... Oh! One. There we go, that's one. Can I... It's two. Okay, I don't think we need any more, right? So we take that. First of all, we need to connect it with the road. That's going to be one hell of an expensive road. So where's the town? Town is over there. Holy moly, okay. Um, can we connect it somehow like this? I think we can, right? Yeah, that worked out. Okay. I mean, 3,000 is not too expensive, but... Right, I want logistics here. Um... Because that's going to be way more efficient for sure. Um, do we have our logistics thing here? Plantation, plantation. No, we don't, right? Okay, so we can build a truck depot over here. You're going to take a uh, fish. You're going to sell it at farmer's market here. And you are going to take fish and uh, send it here. And you're going to take fish. And send it 16. There you go. Okay, so now we have the fishing route. Got another tech point in logistics. So now we can actually do this. There you go. We got another dispatch slot, which means now we can actually sell those bloody eggs. Where are the eggs? Uh, so there you go. Okay, destination. Yes. Okay, first of all, eggs. Logistics, truck depot 14. And now you have another slot. So you're going to... Uh, transfer those eggs to the truck depot. What was it? Two. Yes. Now this truck depot is going to sell those eggs on the market. We're doing things. It's somehow working. Okay. Uh, commercial market. I think they buy eggs, right? Yep, they do. And they have quite a demand for them. All right. Cool. So we are doing that. I mean, we had 170,000 income last month, which is not bad. Um, okay. How does our experience look, R&D points? So we are soon going to get a farming thing. And yeah, we literally can't really do anything about this now. So we, we want cheese and for cheese we need... Um, we need to research cows, right? So this is what we're missing. So this is gonna be quad quadrupeds, yes. Unlocks the ability to place five fields. Okay, no, we just want cows. Let's increase that. Let's meanwhile search. Maybe there's other good place that can do fishing. So let's see, do you guys want fish? Not really, okay. Do you guys? Oh, we already have a fisherman there, damn it. You guys want fish? You already have a fisherman as well. Ah, come on. 
I have my fishermen here. What about these guys? They probably do want fish, but they don't have any lakes or anything near them, right? Mm, okay, he's fishing all the way here. Okay. Well, that's quite a fishing empire he got there. All right. Um, let's see. I wonder if I can build another one maybe here. How much does it bring in? There are stats, uh, so dispatch costs 800, 900. Um, okay, nine. How do I know how much money does this bring me? This is the question. Mm. Like, there's this is this is like you know definitely something that's missing from the game is the fact that you cannot look at the how much the building produces, so you don't know like if you're managing it efficiently or not. Okay, we got, so we can unlock cows. There we go. So we can now actually build a more complex thing. Let's see, we have, we have stuff here. So we can maybe do it here. Um, so what was it again? So we got uh, meat, milk, right? So we got a cow. It needs wet water. Can it just collapse, please? So we need a wet farm. We need water and we need, yeah. So I guess let's build it in a completely separate thing. We haven't built anything here yet, I think, right? So we can um, have enough money. Oh, okay. So I guess permits go in price all the time you buy them. Uh, oh, no, I already have a permit here. Okay. All right. I built a depot here. Right. Okay, cool. Um, so we might as well build it here. So we need the water thing. Um, maybe just straight up connect it. So one two three take the roads connect it over there okay uh water so we need water we need wet farm crop farm it's just connected like this right we need a crop farm two three four Five. Okay, we got that. So you deliver. Oh, and I now have two destinations, so I don't really need a logistics bid here, which is great. And uh, you are going to produce wet. And now we need to build the animal farm, right? So livestock farm. Base this, this, and uh, must be. Oh, there's. Uh... Yeah, that looks fine. So, and you are going to produce cows. Yes, there you go. There's actually three things is going to produce. So, we're still not going to be able to ship one of them, which is somewhat annoying. Okay, so you are going to take this to the livestock farm to cow. Yes. Um. So, this is... Oh, yeah. And you need to take water there as well. So, farms, uh, livestock farm, cow. Okay, so this will get water. This will get wet. And... Now we need the logistics bit. Truck depot. One. So we already have a truck depot here. They milk. They do buy milk. And okay, so we produce what? We produce milk and we produce meat. Okay, cool. So okay, we actually need to set up. Uh, so take meat. You take it to truck depot seventeen. Take milk and you take it to truck depot seventeen. Okay, so and then truck depot 17 takes uh, meat and takes milk. Wait a second. We did that because we wanted to actually build the um, food factory, right? Food factory needed what? Um, food factory cheese, water and milk. Perfect. So we can actually make cheese, which is great. The question is, can we sell it in this town? Because I'm an idiot. And I forgot to check that. Um, Guessing that's not going to be the market is going to be something like not hardware store, I guess, wholesaler, iron ore. Um, I guess they don't really care about. OK, so basically we're going to sell. Going to sell meat and we're going to sell. 10, OK, and we're going to sell. Uh, no, 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 we're going to sell milk and we're going to send meat because I'm an idiot. That's absolutely fine. Come on, come on, save it already. Okay, so this is depot 10. 
I'm gonna take that meat and sell it in the market, and you're gonna take this milk and you're gonna sell it in the market as well. Right, so now we have another chain. Now we need to find someone who wants cheese because we now have a very complex thing to uh, that we can produce, but uh, we just have to find a buyer for it. Let's see, uh, maybe right click would be better. Do you want to buy cheese? Um, so we got liquor store. I doubt they want to buy cheese. Um, hey, Finny TV, how's it going? Yeah, sure. Quick summary. It's basically Transport Tycoon Deluxe, but. Uh, more uh, updated i guess and with more complex production chains so it's like you know you set up your empire and then uh, produce things and sell them and try to outsell your competitors so i'm trying to build stuff that is basically selling well i don't know if it's going well or not i mean at least you know i'm kind of earning something not perfect whoops that is a wrong button okay they don't seem to be buying cheese at all which is a bit weird um, right. Do you guys want to buy cheese? Is there anyone here? So there's a diner here, but they want to buy orange juice, apple smoothies, soup and apple pie. I don't know how to make any of those. Farmer's market. Why don't they buy f cheese at farmer's market? That's weird. Okay, wholesaler. There's a Stanford. Okay. They don't buy cheese as well. Well, that was absolutely useless. I like to buy cheese as well, but apparently none of those towns do. So, okay, this is food, farmer's market, um, no, also no, okay. I just unlock it for nothing, I mean, I now sell milk and, and meat, but... Okay, let's see, farmer's market, I guess it does not go to farmer's market, it should be sold somewhere else. Lumber yard, so this is like super tiny and always here. Mm, let's see, maybe this Benton thing. Farmer's market, no, okay, so it's definitely not farmer's market. Hardware store, I feel like I should requalify into like, may maybe picking farmer as a specialty was a bad idea, I don't know. Okay, farmer's market, a hardware store, also paper mill, okay, those are all my competitors actually, so not, not very good. Um, right, how's my income looking? 40k so far. I have 5 mil left, not that much. Alright, what about these guys? Farmer's markets. Nobody wants cheese. What is what is wrong with you people? Construction goods. I don't know how to produce that. Um, Yeah, that's not very good. Bookstore. You can produce books and stuff. Okay, that's interesting. I haven't seen that before. Right, let's see the tech tree. So we got... Uh, we're actually quite... Far. Okay, we got, we're going to get the logistics point next. We can get train terminals. Oh man, I want to train. I want to transport something by train. I don't know if it'll... <laughs> it's probably going to be bad for me, but I, ju I just want to unlock train. I, I want some trains. The next question is, can you get more loans? So I want to get more money. So right now we're actually spending money and not earning anything. Mostly because last time I spent quite a lot on building stuff, right? Okay, so we have 150 building upkeep and uh, not enough selling. Okay, that is not particularly good. So get another logistics point. One dispatch slot on every building or four dispatch vehicles on every building. You know what, let's go for vehicles because I feel like some of my buildings might be underperforming because there's not enough uh, trucks for them, right? So do I... Okay, we can, uh, how many trucks do we have? Oh, we have nine trucks, okay, now I see. So we have to, like the fact that you have to manually balance this is somewhat annoying, I guess. Why not all tracks, want all of those tracks on this? Okay, so you have to actually met. Right, okay, those, this bit is definitely slightly annoying. I wish they would change it so that you, you know, you don't have to manually assign all of the trucks because this is kind of ridiculous. Like there's only one destination, so just put all of them there. Now I have to, do I really have to go through all of that and do it myself? So yes, all the tracks. I guess maybe that's not efficient, but uh, that's, that's, yeah, there's definitely some minor annoyances here and there, but 
as I said, this is a game in development. So as, as you can see here in the lower bottom corner is version 0 0.5. So there's definitely going to be a lot of updates and fixes. But, okay, so let me put more tracks on work. And let me put more tracks over here. Whoops. That is not what I wanted. Uh, back. No. Yes. There you go. Okay, so the, they, they were literally not delivering all that fish that was stacked in there because reasons. It, okay, this is definitely annoying. All right, let's see. Um, is there any more problems like this? So we had this farm here. So we got store. Yeah, okay. No, it's, it's a water, right? So this should be fine. Okay, I'm going to throw in all the trucks for delivery anyway. Because there's no reason to give them stale, right? I think... It may be that I'm mistaken, it's actually a mechanic within the game and I just don't understand it. But, um, yeah, I have a feeling, I mean, maybe, so because the, each track dispatch has a price on it, so that might be that what I'm doing is entirely wrong and dispatching so many trucks is actually bad. But, um, we're gonna see how that works out. So what do we have here? We have this truck depot. All right, I'm delivering stuff here as well. So this, I should put more trucks on this um, this route indefinitely, right? So this is the long one. We're gonna put more trucks on it. There you go. There they go. Oh god, holy sh! Why is there so many vegetables stored in there? Okay, no, there's gonna be four trucks. Yes, there you go. Just definitely some of those things are not optimized, which is ugh. Okay, I uh, got all of that. Let's see. Would be nice to have some sort of a list of my buildings, which is like, you can create trade routes, but that doesn't really help me right now. Okay, I think those are mine as well. Um, another complaint is quite kind of hard to distinguish between mine and not mine um, things or buildings, I guess. So I'm gonna put, so this is the furthest one. Let's go put five there. So more trucks here. <laughs> it's just billion of trucks spawned. I'll take that. Got a truck depot. Okay, cool. Um, we did that. So are we earning any money now? Let's see how this month ends. I have a feeling there's gonna be way better because of all those optimizations. Uh, storage is not filled, so that's good. We were doing what here? I don't honestly remember. I guess it delivered from somewhere else, from here, I think. Truck depot, yes. Okay, um, oh yeah, right, this was the thing, so... More trucks. Okay, this storage is also, like, overfilled, god damn it. So, okay, yes, more trucks. Water siphon, more trucks. Okay, this actually works relatively well because they are close. What about those ones? Crop farm, destination, three, yes, please. All of the trucks, just just do it. Truck depot, yes, all of the trucks. This also has a, yeah, okay, this has a billion of stuff in storage. Um. Oh man, how do I do that? Right, crop farm, throw in more of that. Yes, thank you very much. This is not mine. Truck depot. Okay, this works out fine. Actually, nobody delivering eggs. So what happens to the eggs now? I did deliver eggs from here, right? No, this is a crop farm. Where, where's my... Where's my animal farm? There it is. Destination, yeah. Oh, I did... It, does it have like a billion? Yeah, okay. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> okay, yeah. I mean, it's it's kind of my own fault for not doing that, but um, that could have been streamlined a bit more. Um, no, C come on, game. Seems to be okay. A billion of meat here, and I don't have any trucks assigned for meat, which is weird. So yeah, I guess we could put more. Oh, and I don't have any trucks assigned to eggs as well. Okay. Yeah, I mean, even though, you know, this is kind of pretty great, but this is a bit weird. Hey, man, man, man. God, God damn it. You and your username. 
Hi, Mehmatrix. How's it going? <laughs> so, um, it is a Transport Tycoon game and it's pretty great. By the way, um, you won my 4,000 subscribers giveaway on YouTube. You have not contacted me yet, so please contact me and uh, tell me what you want to do with that one hour of time you won. So I did reply to your comment on YouTube. Uh, you can comment... Uh, damn it. You can contact me either on YouTube or here or in Discord or, you know, Twitter or whatever you like. Yeah, so just please ping me and let's figure out uh, something you want to do, basically. Okay, um, do we have... I don't have any points here, so the industry is like literally lacking. Oh, we're gonna get another point in tech in here. So what can we do? We can get more water, but I don't really think we need more water, right? So what can we get more fish, but that also doesn't really help. Sand collector. So what does it give? Build sand collectors. Why do you need sand? Okay, let's see. Uh, recipe book, factories, where's the gatherers? So, sand collector. It produces sand, I assume, right? So, why do you need sand? Can you search for stuff? Sand. No, that, that's not very helpful, game. Wanna know why... Okay, yeah, I know you can get it from there. What I do with it? <laughs> um, okay, I guess I don't really do anything with it. So, let's go for Lumberyard. We actually got a second tier, which is nice. Okay, copper mine, our mine... Okay, water mill. Oh, so there are some non-implemented things here still. Okay, production alert. Destination storage is full. Oh, no. Um. Yeah, of course. God, come on, GameStop. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, come on. There we go. Storage. That looks good. Okay. Uh, yes, I have to tweak that. So we got more of this. Whoops. Yeah, hey, wait a second. I'll just assign more trucks and it won't be full anymore. Um, there we go. That looks fine. Livestock farm, production trucks. So, I just... Ah, damn it, game. Why is there zero trucks assigned? Okay. Um, truck depot storage. Okay, so how many trucks do we have? We have zero. What is... Okay, half of my pipelines do not work because I'm an idiot and didn't assign any trucks to them. Okay. That looks good. Um, how is it full? No, it's not full anymore. What are you? You're lying to me. Send to cow farm. Wait, is it this destination is full? Oh, yeah, it is full. Okay. So I guess I could say that you can also... Wait, do they... Here's the question. Can I sell the leftovers to the farmer's market or something? I guess nobody really wants to buy that right um, maybe a wholesaler can I sell it to wholesaler choose destination commercial states can I sell it to stay what did it give me okay states um, okay no so what does sending to state does there you go just just send one more truck Okay, are we positive? We are still not positive. We are... So, okay, so those minus 80,000 is actually your monthly balance. This is bad because we're losing money. Okay. What can we do to earn more money? Why is, there, why is we losing so much money here? Okay, so we do that. I'm guessing selling vegetables is not exactly profitable here anymore. No, it's still profitable. Okay. Fully supplied. Okay, cool. We're still doing that. We got this truck depot. Okay, use now eggs and get some trucks here. I mean, I guess we can actually probably decrease this water delivery because we don't really need so much water and increase the selling bits, right? Uh, okay, so this storage is empty, which is a good thing. This storage is empty, which is also a good thing. And this also looks fine. Okay, so we're actually quite good. In this case. Um, 
Those are all not mine. I'm not gonna touch that. Let's see, are we good here? So we yeah, we took all the trucks here, all the trucks from here go there. Truck depot, yes. Yeah, so we're selling that. And how's the market looking? They well, okay. Fish is pretty pretty good. And there's nothing I can do about it, game. Just stop it. Actually render cows there. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Okay. It's lacking water. So why does it not get enough water? Oh! Because there is nobody delivering water there. Right. Cut. Okay. There really has to be warnings about that as well. It's like, hey, you know, this thing's not producing anything because you don't deliver water. Got two points for what? We got one point for farming. So we can one more to unlock all those passives. Do I want to unlock five fields for livestock? Why not? Let's go with that. Be like livestock specialization. We got lowers cost of building, lowers initial cost of building, speed of fields increased, increases storage capacity and decreases farm upkeep, which is always great. I guess we unlock that as well. So do you want to go for trains? I don't have that much money, but you know what? I'm just going to go for trains. I want trains. Okay, yes, I know that you cannot deliver it because they don't have water. Okay, now we are more or less fine, or I guess better than before. So what does sending it to state do actually? Does it sell it there? Oh, that's actually, oh, that, that is actually very handy. So I didn't know that you could just click on the town name and see all the businesses. So the wholesaler. Okay, uh, yeah, just stop with this stuff. I know that it's busy and everything. Oh, okay, we started making more money because I finally made some of my things work properly. That's a good thing. Okay, let's see. Um, I want to train. I want to build a train. It's probably going to be most of my money but uh you know what so we have we can build it for fish why not it's a, the fish on a train that's the best thing ever right so we got a train terminal okay how the hell does it work is that a road connection yes okay we got another train terminal Uh, nah, nah. Okay, those saves are somewhat annoying. Come on, you can do it asynchronously in the background. Don't don't block the UI thread for, for that stuff. Okay, can we? Here's the question: Do those guys want fish? Because we can sell them fish using trains. They don't actually want fish. God damn it! All my dreams shattered. You want fish? No. Um. Yeah. Right. I forgot Steiner. Our restore construction goods. Deadly. Okay. Let's see. I mean, I guess, okay, like, right, fine. You know what? Let's, let's deliver our fish with train to them. There we go. And I think I screwed it up, but... Uh, track. So, how do I... I think that's a terrible idea and I have to demolish this and rebuild it. Okay, let's try that again. Like this, I guess. And uh, so to be fair, we have to build it something like... Uh, maybe like this. This is, this is the worst planning ever, but I just want to see trains. I don't care. Okay, I'm going to spend all my money on tracks, but... Also, um, cut. I built that the wrong way as well. <laughs> Jesus. No. Build the road. There you go. Okay. Um, let's see. Train. Can we build like this, maybe? Okay. Tracks. There we go. I hope there is a proper crossing there and they won't collide with cars, which would be very unfortunate. Okay. 
are doing things. I just want to see some trains. Okay, um, that doesn't seem to be connect connected. What the game? What are you doing with my tracks? That is not how it should look. Okay. There we go. That's much better. Now, delete that. Now, where's the other one? Nope. And, uh, okay, cool. So we connected them. Which means now we take this. We take the destination logistics uh, train terminal 2. Yes. You take this fish. And uh, you deliver it to train terminal 2. Yes, exactly. Okay, cool. I also have nine trains for whatever reason. Fine, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. Okay, you take the fish and you deliver it to track depot here. You know what? I'm gonna take this track depot and destroy it. There we go. So we are gonna be... Yes, remove that. Well, no. So you deliver this to terminal, you take the train and deliver this to other train. This is the the most obscure way of delivering fish, but you know what? I want to see trains. Show me the train. I wonder if there's like airplanes as well. Is that plants? Let me see. We got a uh, highway Zeppelin fill. Oh my god, there's Zeppelins. Where are you going? No, you are going to the wrong way. Um, this is where you're supposed to go. Why are you going there? No, this is the <laughs> Oh my god, this is the other way around. Even terminal one. There you go. Are they delivering to one now? Yes, okay, cool. So I screwed up the first time. There's the train. I just want to see one train. Just show it to me. Why are they going all the way there? What is... Is it not connected somehow? It should be connected, right? Yeah, it is connected. What the... Okay. I think really, they're going to deliver it here. From... Wait... Did I just build two train terminals so that it will deliver the stuff with trucks? Are you kidding me right now? No, are you furry? Wait, 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 how did, wait, what the? Trucks. I don't want trucks, I want trains. God damn it. Come on, game. I'm actually earning money now, which is great. What is not great is, how do I... What do I do to get trains? I don't have... Diesel engines, conductors... Can build train terminals. So I build a train terminal, but they still deliver stuff between them on trucks. That doesn't make any bloody sense. How do I get a train? Um, right. Okay, you know what? I'm not even gonna question that. Um, I mean, we got positive, at least a bit. I guess delivering stuff on trucks between two train stations also works. <laughs> so, that, uh, now it's negative. Okay, but we was positive for the last one, so that's good. There's like almost half a mil. Not bad. Seems to be working, finally, after I adjusted all of those things. So, this stuff seems to be clogged anyway. Maybe I can sell it over. Um, can maybe subtract that. I don't know. Does shipping it to state sells it or what does it do actually? They don't need to give a bit some more explanation of what the hell's going on. But yeah, um, I think that's a good point to wrap it up. So we did, you know, build a small empire. I guess it's definitely worse than the one that the PC has, but uh, it works and we got some money. So it's good. Let me just uh, exit the main menu. So, yeah. Um, 
thank you for watching, I guess. So this is the Rise of Industry available on GOG.com or Steam, I think. It's still in development, but uh, looks pretty promising. Some nitpicks and uh, annoying things here and there, but I hope they will be fixed. But it actually seems to be a pretty great game with a lot of very complex um, processing pipelines that you can create, actually. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Right. So that would be a good point to stop. Um, thank you for watching. And as usual, I see you next time. Bye.